Welcome back everybody, I'm meteorologist Hayden Nix along with Miss Kelsey Cowan with the Museum of Discovery for our next at home discovery episode. Now this one is called gunpowder painting. So adults, hello! Supervision is absolutely a must and you must participate in this because there's a couple of components that you have to handle because it's going to be involving the gunpowder and also flames. So make sure that you're helping out with this, but it's a fun, fun experiment. To do with the kids. So Absolutely. Walk us through this kids. Yeah, so parents, you did hear right. It does involve gun powder. Yeah. So that is going to be one of our ingredients. But a couple of our other ingredients we're going to have is just a thick, heavy duty plate. Got it. Just no kind of flimsy plate isn't going to work quite as well. It might burn, ruin your masterpiece. Okay. Thick, heavy duty paper plate. One that can hold the big pile of spaghetti like the commercials, that, right? You got it. Okay. You know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> Uh, but you also need some tape. Just okay. some masking tape is what we're using. Um, and basically, it's going to be a little bit harder to burn, that initial burn. So that's what we're looking for is kind of this masking tape. Got we it. got some thin masking tape here. But this is actually going to be like our pencil, our pen. It's going to be our drawing tool. Got it. Okay. So what we're going to do, I want you to think of something to draw uh, with your tape, of course, and, uh, and go for it. So we're going to create basically an image. Um, I went to good old Texas a and I'm from Texas. Um, so I am going to do a little Texas A&M symbol and hopefully no Razorbacks will get on to me necessarily. You know what, I say that I'm a meteorologist every time we go on here, so hopefully people have maybe led to thinking that there's gonna be some kind of weather-related component <laughs> to this, possibly. This could be the time. But I'm not a great artiste, so I hope that it represents what I want it to be. It'll be fantastic. Now, when you're actually creating this image, just keep in mind that wherever you put the tape, it's actually going to be ending up the color of the plate. So in this okay. case, it's just going to be white. Okay. Um, and then the uh, actual plate itself, so wherever you don't have tape, is going to end up being uh, the color of the gunpowder. Um, so probably not going to be a kind of darker brown or black. Got actually. it. So, so this, the tape is acting like a, a, a protector of the plate. Exactly. To keep that part clean. It's keeping it nice and clean. And we're, of course, in the film or the photography world, we're going to be creating what we call a negative image. Okay. So in which um, our canvas, of course, is going to be kind of the, the one we're actually going to be changing a little bit. Right. While, yes, that tape is going to be remaining the same. Oh, that is looking. Oh, look at that! That is fantastic. Can you figure it out at home? <laughs> it is certainly weather related. Yeah. Absolutely. A cloud of lightning bolt. I'm almost finished with mine as well. I'm really curious to see how this is going to be. <laughs> this is going to be so good. <laughs> okay, so. All right. Here we go. I've got Texas A&M. Okay, you. thank okay. you. Again, raise your backs. I'll it's okay, it's okay, we can be friends, yeah. we can be friends. Uh, but what we're going to do next is we actually need to get that gunpowder on. So Got it. And of course you have. can buy the gunpowder at a local big box store here. Just do your research and be able to quickly find it. Absolutely. That. Now, to get it to stick on there in particular, okay. we actually have some tacky spray. So this is actually what's going to stick on. So what we're going to do first, we have actually have a towel right. right here. Um, just in case uh, we don't get it all over anything else, we don't want to get everything sticky. So get that tacky spray all over that plate. Fantastic. Is that good? That's a fantastic. Maybe a little bit more, just kind of all around. There you go. And then as soon as you're done, what you're going to do is get that gunpowder on. You all were over right the about the tackiness. Yes. And I'm going to do the same thing to mine. There we go. That should be good. Okay. Looking good. And yeah, don't be generous. You're going to be spreading this all around. I'm going to show you guys as well. Trying to spread it all around as best as I can. It, as soon as you actually um, use that tacky spray, that's going to be, um, of course, the best time to put your gunpowder on. So don't just wait, because it's not going to work near as well. So if you need to kind of spread out your hand, well, that looks perfect. Like uh, that. Spread out quite as well. Absolutely. That's okay. perfect. Now, what we're going to do next, this is the dangerous part. So what we're going to do, we're going to have to go outside. Got it. And we're going to need a few other things. Now, okay. number one, I actually have um, some glasses, right? You have some safety glasses because we're all going to be dealing with fire and, of course, gunpowder. Um, but we also have um, a fire extinguisher. This is right over here, so we'll have it right nearby. Um, in addition, we have a propane torch. Now, this torch can reach high temperatures. Of course, there's going to be a flame coming out of it. And 
We're going to actually put it on a nice area that's not going to be have flammable things around it. Got it. Um, go outside, find a nice space, and then we're going to kind of get arm's length away and actually try to see if we can get that flame close and create that puff of smoke from that gun tapper uh, with our propane torch. So gotcha. we're going to have to be extremely careful uh, doing that. And when we get done, hopefully, we can come back in and have some masterpieces. Okay. All right. We've got something here, as you can tell. Uh, oh, okay. I think, I I think that one, yeah. Okay, let's swap here. So, what we're going to do now, we actually used our gunpowder, as you can see, mm -hmm. and now we're back inside and we are going to see our image. We're going to reveal it. All you have to do now is take off that tape. Okay, okay so. Oh, it's looking good. Oh, uh, we go. image. It's looking good so far. Okay. Oh, yes. Not bad, not bad. bad. Oh yeah, okay, I can see your cloud okay. so far. That's looking good. Get the edge there. This is looking good. The cloud looks okay. I'm kind of concerned about the lightning bolt. Beautiful. <laughs> okay. Look. Okay, got a little, little piece of tape left. Ah. Uh. Oh, that is fantastic. That's really cool. That is incredible. I loved it. Again, I'm representing the Aggies over here, but I think two wonderful pieces, wouldn't you say? Uh, I'm hanging this up. <laughs> Maybe on the wall. I'll frame it. This is going to look great. Kelsey, thank you so much for letting us come by and check this out. Of course, you don't let those creative juices flow. You could do this multiple times over because you'll probably have a big bottle there. But again, like she said, adults, please help out with this. And just have some fun with this. Absolutely. You are absolutely going to enjoy it. So go and try it out. And don't forget to go to our website, kark.com forward slash science, because that's where our next Admiral Discovery episode will be located when they're launched on Mondays at 1 p.m. See you guys.